After many years passed, I decided to follow up with the current Island Burial Council board members of my accomplishments. Uh, Kilney, you're here for? Mahalo Nui, thank you so much uh, for allowing me to be on the agenda. I just kind of wanted to give everybody an update. You know, it's been about 25 years in the fighting of to try and get our burial cave uh, protected and preserved. So today I own the whole entire cave. I don't consider myself as an owner. I'm a steward, always been. Um, so do you own the whole property the cave's on or just where the cave, the, the length of the cave? Uh, no, I own the whole thing. The whole thing, okay. Yeah. The, yeah. All so right the boundaries, now, everything there. Yeah, so I own, okay. um, it, it's in three parcels right now. From the owner, myself, I'm saying that I would like the whole property to be a buffer zone. I don't want anything to be built on there, any hale in Pretoria forever. It's very special that you are a descendant and the landowner. Your, what you're doing is exactly what needs to be done, but the beauty of it is that you don't have to pull teeth with some landowner who's, you know, from Aina A and everything and doesn't know left and right. You are, as an Ohana, making the decisions that are best for your Ibi Fukuna. Uh, Kioni, uh, mahalo for your testimony, and I personally will support you in your efforts. But then again, thank you so much for yep. your, your testimony. Mahalo, Nui. Thank you. We move by that, so. Yeah. Um, hey. It's refreshing to um, have a young person such as yourself undertaking this kuleana. Um, it's, it's, it's refreshing. I love it. It's so good. Good feeling. Now, Manao is my kai. You're setting a plate for our future generations to, to succeed and also an example for our, our young people to come forward and step up to this. But I just congratulate you. It's really awesome, your work. Mahalo, eh? Mahalo, Thank you. Mahalo, mahalo, mahalo. Yeah, Kioni has taught me a lot about the burial sites, you know, what it took, uh, the timing that it took, the, uh, the prep amount of preparation that the Hawaiians would go into a ceremonial, you know, burial site. And they were really um, respectful of their gods and they really wanted to protect the souls that comes from these people. And that's what makes it so interesting because it's not just one part of Hawaii, it was spread straight across Hawaii and you know, every island. For him to educate people and for him to, you know, teach me and educate me just makes us all like really uh, appreciate where we're from.